Well, this is a special time of year in the European footballing cycle. It's where it all begins again. The lifting of the trophy, the winners' medals. That was all back in May. A mere reminder, a wreck of the glory that was and what may be to come, perhaps, for one of these. Is a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game in stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. So it's back, bigger and better than ever before. We hope everybody is ready for another ride on the emotional roller coaster. Bring it on, Peter. I'm looking forward to a competition that always delivers entertainment, whether through its football or indeed its supporting cast of, of emotions. Neither of these teams will want a, a trip back to the drawing board after this, so I think we can expect something quite lively. That gets things running. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Yeah, Roberto Firmino. Pretty much the ultimate team player, Peter, in that he gives his teammates a real lift and makes everyone feel better. He can drop deep to pick up the ball and create chances for others, or drift wide to drag defenders out of position. And that versatility makes him really hard to defend against. He's also full of running, and he's extremely effective in that first line of defence. I think the opposition defence agree too. He's going to be the source of so many of their headaches. Robertson. Alexander-Arnold. Well positioned to make that interception. Gorgeous control there. Chiesa. He's had a shot. Big relief. It just needed better contact. Chiesa certainly caught it well enough, but that was never really going to trouble the keeper. Rebic. Just brushed off the ball there. And it's Firmino. It's a loose ball. And he heaves it forward. Van Dijk. That's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. Just a whisker away. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. And the weighted pass. Promising move that. Good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Hernandez. Romagnoli. Firmino, Jota. Chance! 
Oh, that is asking for trouble. Jota. And here's Roberto Firmino. Now it's Roberto Firmino. Henderson. Has a goal! He can get that clear. Oh, nearly. But nearly is nothing. His reputation is better than what we've just seen. It's a brilliant interception. It's come loose. Jota. Jota! He's pulled off a fine save. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes work ultra sharp. Didn't quite meet it right. Fabinho. Plays it long. Chiesa. Oh, that is lovely footwork. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Uh, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. There could be trouble here. But for now, the referee is keeping his cards in his pocket. So the last big chance, perhaps, before half-time. Tries to float one. Looked to surprise the keeper, but missed the target. There's no doubt he made the right decision, but without the right result. Hernandez. Rebic. Hernandez. Tomori plays it forward quickly. The referee's had a look and he's blown his whistle for half time. So both sides have drawn blanks and have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. The midway point of the game. Liverpool really did turn up the tempo at the end of the half, and while they'll be disappointed not to have broken through, obviously, the chances will come, provided they can keep producing good spells. It's been a half with significantly more positives than negatives, I feel. Liverpool head to the dressing room, not yet having broken through. Tight, cagey game. Neither team any further forward than they were when they started out. We're probably into the second 45 minutes. Liverpool clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game and... Has a pop! Big moment! Massive goal! Well, when one or two others were maybe a tad slow at restarting this game, then up steps a big character who was simply switched on and bright, and he sparked another advantage for his team at an important stage. It all goes well. Liverpool are looking strong on the break. Winning the ball in midfield is one thing, but it's their clever use of counter-attacking. That's the real highlight. Liverpool break the deadlock. Oh, half-time has been a blessing for this team. You know, what a great start to the second half. He's left his man. And here's Hernandez. And he's straight offside. Calabria. Alexander-Arnold is effectively being marked out of the game here. 
Yeah, and it's about time they woke up to the main threat, who had license to deliver pretty much unchecked. Revic. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Jota. Kessier. Now it's Shiru. Samu Castillejo. Gets wrestled off the ball. And it's Firmino. Jota already of course. Oh, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Robertson tries a shot. It's bounced out. It's in. Two up now, and they are cruising. Wow, he was never going to miss from there. Our players like this fella almost have a sixth sense to get themselves in such great coaching positions. How quick-minded was that? Now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. So that's two now without reply. Well, with this kind of authority, Peter, why not push on and, and totally kill this off? Brandt. Cut out in the nick of time. Walk forward, what does he try from here? Romagnoli. Kessier. Tomori. Dashing forward at pace. And he's cut it out. Gets good distance on it. And that has put pay to that. Liverpool are able now to make their substitution. It's been on the cards for uh, a few moments now. Jota taking his leave here, having got himself on the score sheet. I think he's put in a good shift, and, and their fans appreciate that. I think he can feel pretty happy with the, the contribution he's made. appear determined to play through the middle again and guess what it's the same result Chiesa plays it out to the flank gets the better of his man he proceeds it all the way And Dyke drives it forward. Chooses to deal with it himself. And it's played forward. Chiesa gets it out to the wing. And Liverpool have a free kick. And he is going into that little black book. Alexander Arnold plays it in. That will annoy the manager. They're making themselves too predictable here. Thiago. Fourth official showing that there will be three minutes of added time. Barrera. Chiesa. Played out to the right. He's got the ball, he's got... Gets up to head it! They are rampant! And 
the lead is three. It is surely done. What a great header. Got plenty on that. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Liverpool, added time is up, and there goes the whistle. Pretty much the ideal start on the first day, a platform on which to build. You look back on the game then, Jim. Well, pressure can quickly build.